Kristen. I'm Chris. And on today's episode, we're taking a look at Botchamania number 406. 406. What's Botchamania? Botchamania is a collection provided to us by Matthew of wrestling fuck ups, muck ups, screw ups, botches, fuck ups, talking too much. Let, let's be honest. With no audience or anything like that. Yeah, very empty arena kind of feel. You know, like, I, I still like how AEW did it. It is better than what the WWE did. Let's not talk about it because I'm still grieving over WrestleMania. I know, so. I know, I know, I know. We'll get to that maybe afterwards. Who knows? But let's dive into this again for Botchamania 406. Say it again. All right, yeah, so, uh, hey guys, it's Danny McCabe, all the way on from Bath. Uh, again, thank you. It's all good. Yep, good. I guess that's kind of a botch. Anyway. Hey guys, Danny McCabe, all the way over from US Venture Bridge, Columbia, the Wizard of Queens Park, the wrestling genius. And not to put myself over too much, I don't know if I necessarily fall within the category of this series of programming, but I certainly do enjoy watching it. And you're watching Botchamania. <laughs> you can you can wash your hands for, for the, the whole, length, of the 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 whole uh, length of the intro. That's a good way to start it. Yeah, I can't. I I tried doing all. It's weird doing all of that. That's the proper show. He's showing you how to properly uh, wash your hands. Wash, wash the media, media four hundred six. <laughs> the following is a three on one handicap match for the Intercontinental Championship. Oh, oh yeah, remember when he interrupted? Oh. Yeah, he got interrupted. Yeah, I heard that. It's funny. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, fuck. No, that was not the spot that scared me. Uh. Oh, his um. Just for further notice, one of your nuts is hanging out of your shorts. You got a big hole. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there was. Yeah, that was a good match. It was. He went with it though. He rolled with it though. That's yeah. a good thing. Shit. Yeah, look at that! Look at that fun move! A lot of slip ups. Yeah. But again, they rolled with it. That was what was good. Oh, this one. Oh, God, his foot. His foot. Ah! Oh. Even I was like, shit. Even yeah. I was in there going, I'm alive, I'm alive, I'm alive. Oh, back when there was arenas full of crowds. Super, hey Chris, Superman punch. Yeah, yeah. What are you doing here? Jesus. Run home, you fool. You, you talk, talk to him. Oh, him. God. Never shut up. You talk too much. Never shut up. Oh, yeah, this match. Definitely. Oh, oh fuck. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. I know that. Grab the title! Grab the title. title! Grab the title! You hear him yelling. You hear him yelling, grab the title. 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 Grab the title.
Grab the belt. Grab the belt. It's like this is your moment. You have to grab it. Oh. Oh. What the fuck are you looking at? Oh, they played his music? Oh, yeah. Because they thought he was finished. I honestly thought he was... Hey, what the fuck? <laughs> I thought he was waiting for somebody to come out. Yeah. She was able to. See, look at. She just rolled with it. That her was foot. good. She rolled with it. I mean, if you do it on a smaller point, I would definitely recommend doing one foot like like yeah. that. Holy shit! What's that? Holy shit! What's that? <laughs> it's called a woman, Jr. Oh God! Oh yeah! This one, yeah. This one. Ooh. The table. She's fine. She's, She's fine. They showed a replay. She did hit it, but like she was. They're supposed to go through the. Table. They're supposed to go through the table. Oh wait for it. This is what I was saying. I think this is what I was. This is what I was saying. I am the table. I'm. That's what Joey Janela was Thanks screaming. Thanks, Because <laughs> Joey was screaming that. I am the table. Listen. From the first week, I asked you how to pronounce your name. Oh, this again. Yes. He told me. I did it. I don't think it's been correct. Okay. So how is it pronounced? Come on. From Dolson, Norfolk, England. Norfolk. Norfolk. It's not Norfolk. It's Norfolk. No food. No food. No no, no food. The R is silent. There you no. go. Better. No food. No food. No food. Did he say tre Tristan? Tristan Roberts is actually pronounced Norfolk. Oh, this. Fucking with him. 
That's what it is. They're still messing with him. Oh, he kicked him in the face. We went to go hit, get in the ring. He hit Marco Stunt in the face when they're trying to get in the ring. Yeah, ow. He tried because he went to swing his leg. Watch. Yeah, I saw it. Yeah. And then it's right. right. Oh, this is fun. This was funny. Yeah, this was. Jingle. You know, <laughs> Jesus, talk about Greg Allison. As they walked out. <laughs> Shaking. Sing it to you. Yeah, I, I was hearing all of that. Oh god, the switch. The, the thing. Jesus Christ. Oh no! Oh god. Don't need a pro wrestling.
on the High Sauce Network with my boy Jimmy Saito on our own show called Spit. Jimmy May, nice to see you here on the Wrestling Community on Twitter with my TikToks. That's it, that's what I'm talking about. But I am here on BoxingMania.com reading this Dream Team Digest report for the May 5th, 2000 edition of WCW Sunday. The main event was a 22-man battle royal featuring 11 Millionaires Club members and 11 New Blood members. And the winners get the WCW title shot. Yeah. The ending features a lot of craziness with Randy Savage making his last ever appearance with the company, Eric Bischoff putting Hulk Hogan through a table, and Bret Hart coming out to no pop. Like, I don't know. It's, I, I was not there. Jeff Jarrett and DDP brought up a scaffold by the entranceway, but with the mass brawling going on, we never saw what happened as the show went off the air, with Hogan and Savage embracing for the last time. And according to DDP Digest, here's why. The show was to end with a stunt where DDP and Jared were fighting on the scaffold. The idea was Arquette would hit Jared with his guitar, and he'd take a bump through a gimmick part of the stage. The only problem was that Asaya accidentally stepped into the gimmick part after she was eliminated. So everyone could see, then Arquette also stepped into it and actually fell in. So DDP and Jared... Oh, he was, he was the, he took the, the spot. He, was supposed he to actually went through the part that uh, were supposed to go Gar- in. Yeah, Garrett, Jared was supposed to go through. Well, they're, they're kind of right. Wrestling kicked ass. That's what it's like, Arquette, don't do wrestling, please. <laughs> he still does. He still does. Hey, I thought I told you to pin those sideburns. Go home. You're off the team for good. Fine. Still, I can better than Steinbrenner. <laughs> <laughs> good Lord, this is a piece of shit. Oh, the giant oh, news! The spider. Like a giant fucking spider show. A Jedi fucking spider shows up. The spider story. I know. I'm sitting there going, really, people? I liked it. It was fine. I caught one with news and another news. Do we need to watch this again? He's got it where he wants it. Goldberg's got speed where he wants it. Can he do this? Can Goldberg do this? He can. He can. He will. Yeah, that's a bow. Shoulders down. He did it. Yeah, that's about right. I've just been handed an urgent and horrifying news story. And I need all of you to stop what you're doing and listen. Whoa! God damn. Oh. So this is a pay-per-view, I believe, a one uh, hey, you. championship. I think I won it or defended it. I think I, I, think I won it. I remember Road Dog coming up to me and goes, did you, did you say fuck out there? And I went, I ain't gonna. Hey, what the fuck? <laughs> I, I, I don't think so. It matches up to something like this. Flat out. And I was like, hey, what the fuck? Oh, I so totally said it. You know what that says? Make reasonable choices. It's an odd thing to get tattooed. Saying some insulting things to me all day. I don't know what happens to a dream that's broken. Does it dry up like a <laughs> <laughs> the Gallagher's fucking giant tattoo? Oh shit, I didn't even see that. Yeah. Oh yeah, Gallagher came back and now he's this fucking asshole. <laughs> so. Katamari Damacy music. Oh, it is. Oh, it is. Wait for it. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Got 
to keep on rolling, 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 right. <laughs> oh, the safety drop, though, is it the safe trust fall? Yeah. Where, like, Miz died. Especially the whole Norfolk thing. Yeah. A Neo Pro Wrestling doing their best as usual. Best as usual and stuff like that. and Just falling flat on his face. I'm sorry, that was the funniest moment. They're like, we're ready, we're ready, here he comes, here he comes. Flat. Uh, go with it, you guys. Okay. <laughs> and just collapse. And just fall. Like, he did hit us. I'm sorry, I was like, what the fuck? That was good stuff. I feel bad for that spot, though, with the big multi-man power royale thing. I felt so bad for that spot. That would be a great spot. Like after that, they're like, okay, we can't invite you on anymore. Yeah, yeah exactly. You need to take a long break from this. Please, you ruined a really good spot. Yeah, so other than that, if you're new to the channel, you can hit the like button. If you want to talk to us more about stuff like this, comment down below. If you want to share us around, share it around. And if you like it just a little bit more than anybody else, when it comes to talking about wrestling right now any wrestling at all hit that subscribe button down below and hit that bell icon as well let us know what you guys thoughts are on this pretty much on uh Bacha Mania. any favorite funny moments that stood out the most to you uh was the one i mentioned uh was there anything else in here that we did not mention that you thought was really funny that really stood out to you the most um put down what you thought of uh, uh of our reactions overall but most importantly we definitely Thank you for watching. So until next time, I'm Kristen. I'm Christopher. And this has been a very pandemic-filled episode of SRV. Okay. See ya. Later. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you want to check out our previous reactions, or any one of our other SRB shows, check out one of our playlists down below. And if you want to check us out in the social universe, you can find us on Twitter and Stardust at Super React Bros.